the link has <coughs> it's a little bit tight, so I need to make it a little bit bigger. Like in the, I don't know why this, I made this shape so that it would have more space for the frame, but somehow it didn't go through the machining. I don't know why, but it's not a big deal. The first three prototypes are always a little bit rough, so so we need to work with work with them by hand. Anyway, the first Evo links I snapped the rear triangles in the first ride because there was a design mistake by me. It was only two millimeter wall thickness in some places and. It started to break down, and then we just needed to live, live, live with it for a while. But now, as we machine everything, it's a little bit quicker than ordering some stuff from Taiwan and then try to weld it together and put it. The welding, uh, because they have production always in the same place, so. Let's try it on. Now we need to take some more material. Still doesn't fit. Looks like so. Let's try the shock. Okay, so we have actually fitted the shock. So, so the machining shop decided to cut off this chamfer from this side. So Basically, we're missing about two millimeters <laughs> from the frame, so we need to have some uh, washers over there. So we're trying to look them. Other, other than that, the, the swing arm is looks great, and, and the stiffness of the swing arm is pretty good. Though. So these these pieces here are solid material. Please. And these pieces are bonded to the whole structure with, with glue. So we glue this together. And then, then there's mechanical attachments here as well. And for the finalized product, we change it a little bit, but not too much. And, and uh, at the moment, the, the swing arm is about the same weight as as uh, our current. It's a little bit uh, uh, lighter, but we won't see if the material, because this is 7075 aluminum, it's around almost as twice as hard as uh, 6065, which is usually used on, on mountain bikes. And we're using the Nebeling 7005 aluminum, which is 15% harder than 6065 heat treat of course so let's see if we can put this together what gives onko se huononnut vielä tätä onko se huononnut vielä tätä tätä alempaa puolta ei sitä sitä en mä en siihen ehtinyt koskea olla aha okei so this hole is too Small, so bigger. This is a, we don't have the right tool for this. We didn't expect, but let's see if the standard drilling tool can. Uh, it goes through. Our workshop is definitely made for this. Oh, 
Well, I think we're. Can I have the axle? So, not that one. Just mm -hmm. This one. Ah, it's here. Well, that yeah, works. Great success. Uh, where's the first one? So, <laughs> so we don't have the axles here, we're just trying to. We're too excited to weigh the axles and we just want, want to see how things come up, come together. So. <laughs> That's not even long enough. So, so this is the rear axle, so we're increasing the, uh, the width, I mean the, the diameter of this axle. We noticed that in Evolinks, this is the these bearings are the ones that are having most of the stress, which is surprising. I, I thought first that these are the ones that are taking the biggest hits, but 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 bicycles are funny funny because uh, you never well you need experience to see where the actual forces are gathering up so uh, it's so complex I would say simple but it's complex so for example the EN test what I've learned is it's not good enough uh, actually this doesn't go through we need to uh, make that hole bigger as well so. so this is the first time we see it actually uh, built up as a whole. Five point three. So we have headset the shock. 5.3, that's quite a lot. Let's take, let's take this off and let's see how much. A few grams, but that doesn't solve the issue. The, my, uh, my calculations, this frame should be a lot, uh, quite a lot lighter than the first one, but uh, we use the same wall thickness here as... Um, uh, like, it's all two millimeters. So... So actually, also the cutting of the frame increases a little bit the weight. If there's, it's not smooth, and in, insides, I think there has been some uh, like a little bit restrictions for the machine. So I need to take a look all one by one. But but still, I'm quite happy about this. It went together, and we just need the axles. So let's see what happens next. <laughs> niin kuin tunnu mitään, mitä nyt tulee. Vittu puolitoista metriä. Niin kuin... But yes, funny. Let's see the result. <laughs> <laughs>